Okay, we made it to the next step. Don't, don't make a liar out of me. I'm going to get another sparkling water and put this on pause for just a moment. Okay, hold for one second. We're back. He's off the zero. Comparison shopped at the grocery store yesterday. Wasn't at Costco. I'm not gonna knock Costco. Sparkling water was cheaper than the Coke Zero I said we're going sparkling this week. Caffeine headache about to pop. You got me confused with you. That's your problem. Also, I know I've said it before, but I stand by it. There is obviously not from a chemistry standpoint, Coke Zero has caffeine. You can see it on the can. From a, a drug response standpoint, there is zero caffeine in a Coke Zero. It doesn't elicit a, a response, at least not a discernible one. You're not getting addicted to caffeine off Coke Zeros. You'd be drinking like 25 Coke Zeros a day, like at the height of your addiction. It doesn't, like, it, it doesn't compute, man. You'd be, you'd be piss maxing. You'd be addicted to pissing. Why do you think they're adding it? I thought it just came naturally in the coca root. I'm not joking. Three Coke Zeros is one cup of coffee? That's what I'm saying. Even if you get addicted to caffeine off Coke Zeros, like, you, you're doing, my, in my personal, you should move to the harder stuff. You should start drinking cold brew. Because I don't believe that you're addicted to caffeine unless I come over to your house and I see you drinking two Coke Zeros an hour. Like, that's, that's the kind of dose you need to trigger the response in your body, bro. Don't you drink cold brew? Yeah. I'm addicted to caffeine. It's got nothing to do with the Coke Zero. If I didn't have a coffee at 5.50 in the morning, yeah, I'd be fucking confused and my nose would be running. I'd have a headache. One Coke Zero, two Coke Zeros, five Coke Zeros. It makes no difference. The Coke Zero has, has none caffeine. It has negligible caffeine. Let's put it that way. If you, if you took the coffee out of my daily routine and I only have one, it would, I would not be feeling amazing. I would be feeling not normal, at least. If you, I mean, because we're doing it right now. You take the Coke Zeros out, I, I feel exactly the same. This is like you're, you're standing next to like the Trinity test of the nuclear bomb. And then someone is like, oh, you should really put like the lead shield over your abdomen when you go in for an x-ray. I'm like, brother, the, the rent gens that I received from Oppie himself have rendered the rent gens I received from this x-ray completely moot. I'm fucked. <laughs> I was standing next to the bomb. I used to also be a two coffee a day, Andy. I'm just a one coffee a day guy now, though. Sometimes, well, it hasn't been probably like eight months since the last time I went to coffee. Well, no, maybe it was like two months, but then it was six months before that. But anyway, <clears throat> the, I always, I, I, I get myself into this cope situation where I'm like, um, oh, I'm a little tired. Maybe I'll have a, uh, maybe I'll have a, an afternoon coffee. And I have like a third of a cup of coffee at 2 p.m., and then my brain is like, you know, fucking 2000s era movie where someone shoots up for the first time. It's like everything starts going like 2x speed and my heart rate is and it's like an x-ray of my veins like narrowing and my heart going. Patum, 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 patum. And then my gut is like. Brrr. It's the Cokes. No disrespect. You don't know what you're talking about. It's not the Cokes, man. The Cokes are not making up the caffeine addiction. If anything, by the way, official name, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. I'm willing to say this because you're using ad hominem attacks against me and one good turn deserves another. If you are affected by the caffeine in Coke, you're weak. Or you're drinking too much Coke a day. It doesn't make you a bad person. I'm just making an observation. Like if you have to buy caffeine free Coke and you don't have like a medical grade uh, uh, allergy to caffeine, my two cents, anytime I see one of those gold cans is I'm like, you got to drink less Diet Coke, man. My mom drinks eight cans a day. That's not my problem. No disrespect. You're letting your childhood trauma affect how you feel about a perfectly sane individual such as myself. You aren't sane. I'm the only sane one here as far as I'm concerned. I'm community center maxing. 
I'm community maxing in general. I'm at the library. I'm pulling weeds. I'm going down to the, the local hardware store and I'm asking, hey, do you guys have any extendable ladders? He says, yeah, follow me into this weird room in the basement. I go down to the room in the basement. There's lots of ladders hanging from the ceiling. I say, how long is this one? He says, looks to be about eight feet. I say, when it extends, how much does it extend to? He says, they usually extend their length plus another half. So I go, this thing goes up to 12 feet. Okay. Then his coworker comes out and says, I, I couldn't help but overhear you guys. They actually extend to 2x their length. And he says, oh, okay, so 16 feet. That'll get the job done. I say, that'll definitely get the job done. They say, do you need help loading it into your car? I say, don't even worry about it. I'm parked right outside. You're going to tell me that I'm not insane? This game is getting too punishing. There really should be checkpoints or something. Let me guess. You try to limit yourself to one Coke Zero a day so the caffeine doesn't make you jittery. Komodo Town. We just took out Komodo Town. I just got downed. You know revived me. Now we're heading eastbound. Now we're at the gates of Canada. See the boss and kill him later. Take me to Canada. Wanna kill the boss. Stop the Mongol invasion. And lives been lost. I really want to. Tsushima with you. You could be the ghost of Tsushima. The ghost of Tsushima.